No, not yet. You can just clean the table. We no. Babe. No, I have to clean Wait, the I table. Thought... Okay. You're recording already? Oh, I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I haven't even set up or anything yet. Get out. Oh. I'm ready. Are you ready? No, you're ready. Go. Did you do it already? Yes. No, stop it. Hi, my name is Chris, and I'm going to give you a quick, brief tutorial on how to beat juggle and mix tracks together. This is for the beginner DJ that uh, has very little experience and wants to learn how to take two tracks and blend them together. I've chosen two tracks that uh, I think we can mix together. Um, what we're looking for is what's called the BPM or the beats per minute. And uh, that uh, basically tells you the um, now you, you're going to have to push the button. No, I, no, no, I already you're, did. You're already recording right now. You so have to push what the button. BPM basically means is the fastness of the song on how fast it plays. And so um, what we have here is it's actually pretty confusing. There's lots of things going around all over the screen so it's it's kind of confusing and a little intimidating when you first see something like this but it's actually it's pretty easy um, it, it, no hold on I kind of miss it. so like I was saying um, beats per minute so this is the beats per minute on this song this is uh, the song I'm going to be using is the thong song by V3 or tricks remix um, and it's it's six minutes long um, and I think this means it's in the key a, and it's still it's it's 128 beats per minute so we're gonna start off with that song and then what we're gonna do is mix this song by Thurs Cali Martyr and uh, we're gonna we're gonna bring them both together, and it's 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 gonna sound really good. And I'm gonna show you how to do this. Um, so what we'll do is we already have the tracks all set up. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this and just start this thing right here. Is that not a lady? this one playing, you're not going to be able to hear what's going on on the other side, and you're not going to be able to mix them both together if you can't hear that. So I'm going to put these on for a second, and uh, I'm going to add a little effects. And... Now I'm going to start bringing the other track into it. Now you have to bring this track up to 128 beats per minute because it started off at 105, and so it was way, way different than the other one. And so we're going to beat match it and bring it in. So that way they both sync up. And if it doesn't, you just scratch this one until it kind of sounds right. And it's almost there. And if you don't like the way it sounds, you can just cut certain things out, like the lows. Or you can just make the lows in the one song. You can bring it into where you can kind of match it. Bring this in a little bit. <laughs> or you can add some effects. It's 
see, kind of all matches up if you just play with enough knowledge.